MP, on the MPK itself. What you want to do is you don't want to go to edit on here. So you see edit right here. Click edit. And then you will press push any of the five transport buttons that you're trying to press, which is these right here. Uh, well, either five of these, which one you want to press. Today so I'm going to show y'all how to, how to hook see. it. See, I already got it hooked up. Just press that. Then press down, then take the knob, out, then take this knob. All the way to MPC. Oh, well, make, make sure it's on MMC. So you can change it. You don't want it on MIDI, you don't want it on MMC to MIDI or nothing like that. You just want it on MMC. Click OK. Save that. Then you go to preset. Uh, this is how you change it too. Um, what you want to do is like as soon as you get to a, like a preset where it tells you um, hit enter. You want to click enter. See. Then you press over and over again and that'll let you change it. And then you press you press it back and then you hit save. All right. All right, now from the keyboard itself, the control, the AKI MPK49 by itself, what we're gonna do is we're gonna, we're gonna slave the ARP and no repeat functions onto Pro Tools. So what we're gonna do with this is we're gonna, so we're gonna take this, as you can see, we're gonna press global, which is this button right here. All right, where it says kill all media, we're gonna press over until you see MIDI clock. And you're gonna make sure you got that on external, which I already got it on. And then you're gonna go over to page 10, you're gonna go to the right to page 10, where it says global page 10, save and set up. Gonna click this button down to save it. And that'll be it. And then Pro Tools as well. I have to get back to Pro Tools. Mm, Y'all give me just a minute. All right, now in Pro Tools, as you can see, I'm gonna go and bring that up a little for it. We're, we're gonna go back to setup, which is right there. And then we're gonna go to um, MIDI. Then you're gonna go to MIDI beat clock. Which is this, and you're gonna click port one. And then you press okay. That's what I'm doing. All right, now you got that situated. 